Hey everyone, this is Greg Bem, your LW Tech Librarian, here again to show you another great resource that we have available to LW Tech community members, students, staff, faculty, anybody that has an ID could get access to these really great sources of information through what we call Infobase, or what was previously known as Facts on File. For this tutorial, because it's been called Facts on File in the past, we're going to continue calling it Facts on File. But you will see Infobase all over the place, so keep that in mind. Um, okay, so here is the main screen of Infobase of Facts on File. You will notice that this page is branded with Lake Washington Institute of Technology. If you do a Google search uh, for this resource, you will come up with it, but you won't see this um, text here labeling it Lake Washington Institute of Technology. So please be sure to go through the library website to access the resources that we have provided Lake Washington Institute of Technology folks because we offer very specific information to meet the needs of this specific community and the students and programs that are here. So here's the main screen. Facts on File includes several major access points um, <clears throat> to different databases. And the databases within are numerous. We currently provide access to two of them, Issues and Controversies and Health Reference Center. Now we used to have more, but they were not used so we got rid of them because all of these cost money. But I'm not going to go into that today. I'm just going to show you the basics on how to get all of the great information within both of these. First, I will show you the current issues, issues and controversy section, and then the medical and health themed health reference center. Please note that you will be able to use both of these in the same way. They're different types of information and they're managed by different people but they both fall under the same platform that Facts on File, or Infobase, has created, which means they're very easy to learn and then know how to use. Chances are, if you're a student in, for example, an English class, you will be more inclined to use the Issues and Controversies section. Uh, if you are in an allied health program, or nursing, or dental, you might find Health Reference Center more relevant to your studies. However, that doesn't mean that these different databases could be used by the opposing bucket of researcher. So keep in mind that you might find health information in issues and controversies and within the Health Reference Center you might find controversial and issue prone information. Before I move on, I will say that there is a great help feature that Facts on File provides and that is down here in the help section. So if you want to learn more about um, how to use this platform and who exactly Infobase is, you can go down there. 